Hello, thank you for joining me today again on the Church History Trail and we're continuing here in the graveyard of the Cathedral Church in uh, Dromore and there you can see Dromore's High Cross there just beside the bridge and of course that's the River Lagan that runs through Dromore but there's a couple of, there's a few wee gravestones here that I'm going to show you and there's this one here and this is very detailed at the top and I'll show you that shortly but it says here erected by Thomas Ferguson and it's of Rathgar Dublin so Thomas Ferguson of Ra from Rathgar Dublin erected this and it's erected in memory of his father John Ferguson Dromore who died 19th of August 1827 age 54 years and then it's first corinthians chapter 15 and verse 54 and also his mother jane ferguson who departed this life on the 19th of september 1810 age 36 years and so that's erected by a man from dublin and you can see the detail here now I'm not sure what they them wee medallions are. They're maybe like flowers or something, but they're decorative anyway. But you can see the detail. You can see the compass there as well. Uh, and uh, I think, no, it's not a compass. I forget what you call that. I can't remember the name of that. But anyway, it's actually, a, a, I'm not sure, but this actually could be a Masonic uh, grave. This man might have been in the Masonic, but I'm not sure because certainly the Masonic do use that symbol. Um, also, you can see the globe there. Again, very detailed. The detail in that is absolutely fantastic. And there's a stars. There's a few stars around that. So I'm not sure where that's a Masonic. This man was in the Masonic or not. He might have been. He might not have been. But I know that's definitely a, a Masonic symbol. But it might just be coincidence. Now, there's another grave down here. And if you can see that, that's 1798. Now, it's not actually, this man I wouldn't have thought took part in the rebellion because he died very old in that year. So I don't think it has anything to do with the rebellion. I think it's the year's just a coincidence. It says here lies the body of, and I can't make his name out. It's almost gone. But anyway, he departed this life in April 1798 but he was aged I think it's 70 odd you can maybe see that better than I can but uh, it has fallen over that grave so there's another wee grave here that I'm going to show you as well which is very old And it's this one here. Here lath the body of Jean. I think that's Mitchell. And I think that's Robert. But as you can see there, it's April, and it's 1752, I think that is. I think that's a two, 1752. So that's an old grave there as well. So thank you for joining me on the Church History Trail. Again, if you enjoy the channel, please like and su subscribe. And you can see the uh, the lag in there so just before i go i'll give you a wee view of the of the river here beside the graveyard there's a wee grave there and it's definitely seen better days that one there's no doubt about it so that's it's a lovely spot for the graveyard isn't it right beside the lagging.
river and there's the bridge and as I say the high cross so thank you for joining me today again on the church history trail and God bless